Hi, I'm Nettie. For the longest time now, I've been meaning to make a video where I try to sound like Voltra. And today, I finally had an opening where I could do exactly that. On top of that, I've gotten countless requests to make a video in the style of Voltra. So today, I'm gonna make some rhythm like Voltra. Also, quick intermission. We're currently doing a remix contest on my song Figment. The prizes for winning include $50, making a YouTube video with me, and more. Join the Discord link in the description to be able to enter and see the full details of the remix contest. Okay, so let's first lay out a drum loop. Okay, and now let's lay out like a vital bass kind of thing. And then let's use like some in a harmonic stretch. And then like turn up the bend all the way. And then we have like a really nice like Voltra kind of mid bass thing. And now let's put this to envelope mode and then do like a little pitch bend. And now let's distort this just a little bit. Let's add like a little sustain note right here. Actually, I think, I think what we can do is just do this and then duplicate this and then add a separate bass here because I think otherwise it would get a little bit like too much of the same bass going on. And then let's change this bass up a little bit to be a little bit less like tonal. Kind of like that. Okay, let's EQ out the sub on this and then let's add in our own separate sub. Let's duplicate this vital patch. And then let's do some more like weird stretching modes. Ooh, yeah, we could definitely do something with that. We'll do like something like this and then modulate this. And then let's add an OTT to that and EQ at the low end. And let's add a disperser. Let's also add a reverb to this. And maybe we can add like a little um, dotted note, like fill in these gaps right here. There we go. That's kind of cool. And let's bring back the low end a little bit. I think the side chain is a little bit long. And I also think this whole thing is a little bit chaotic. Hold on, let's, let's kind of like tone this down. Okay, let's get another vital patch. And then let's see if we can make like a little digital sounding thing. So let's take this. That mode and then like we'll just do like a little let's saturate this a little bit let's add a little bit of disperser i think this main thing could also use a little bit of saturation and then let's mess with the uh random amp right here and kind of get it on a different point so let's add a macro and then let's move this around yeah let's do this there we go. We can also saturate this thing a little bit more. Okay, and then we can cut everything out right here. And then we'll add a classic, like, saw wave detuned kind of, like, melodic fill. Like that. And then let's give it a little bit of a K. And then a, like, filter down like this. And then let's do an octave up like this. And then let's add some ping pong delay, like this. Okay, and then we can duplicate this bass. Okay, let's duplicate this patch, and then we can like work on this separately, and then let's tone this down just a little bit. Let's give this a little bit of a K as well. Actually, I think we can just kind of remove this entirely. There we go. Let's raise the volume of this. Okay, this is way too loud. Okay, so let's make this filter go like down slowly. Like that. Let's grab an auto filter and then we'll just bring this down as well. And let's duplicate this patch. And we could probably add some like, you know, digital sounding bits and bobs here. Let's just start over here. Okay, let's get a serum and then FM two sine waves together. This one is like all the way up. They're both all the way up. Course knob is all the way up. And then FM this. Okay, let's EQ this because it really hurts. Let's change this up a little bit. Just frequency shift it around. And then let's also frequency shift this around. Let's split this into bands of like high end and low end so that we don't frequency shift the low end out. There we go. And then maybe we could do something with the melody. 
Okay, now let's do like a switch up where we have like a long sustain base playing. Oh, what? Dude, that's sick. That's so sick. Okay, hold on. Let's duplicate this. Oh, that's way better. Okay, and let's also duplicate this patch. Ooh, we could take that and like frequency shift it. Okay, and then let's remove this thing. And then we'll add like a little percussion sound. There we go, I think that's good. Okay, let's put this thing in octave up. There we go. Okay, and let's remove this thing and put it like... What is this? Ooh, what is this? Dude, yeah, let's, let's slap it on there. And then let's also put the sub here. Okay, let's remove like the uh, collapse right here. And then maybe we can remove like the filtering on this. All right, so at this point, I'd say it's pretty much done. So let's go ahead and take a listen to this track. And just like that, we've made a drop like Voltra. Let me know if you like this video with a comment down below. Leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you in another video. Goodbye.